I shall remember a car cry. Ah, move far from. Move far from. I said, "You are not a man." Man, you are a single only boy. High pass. 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 High so, okay, so shake it, 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 shake it. So on the count of three, let's all say it's our moon foundation. So one, two, three. Let's go step. Yay! Boys, now you're wild. And finally. So it's a moment for this. Yeah, it's been a success. It's finally launched. If you need information about it, go on Instagram, you find it. Yes. More for her own. And so I'm looking for my PA. PA, don't you know Yeah, scared of cameras. So when they see no, Miss G, welcome. You said I watch it, man. Who's to watch it, man? Are you serious? Hey, okay, I'm a chauffeur in my name. It's now. I'm a chauffeur in my name. 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 I'm a chauffeur um, we are currently admired to hotel for a purpose, you know, you know. and that is to celebrate actress and the launch of a foundation. We pray and ask for your blessings that you may come and take absolute control of further what you're going to do here. That at the end, our name praise will surely be given unto you. Begin with us and end with us. Through Christ Jesus' name, I pray. Thanksgiving. Amen. What did you do? almost all by myself so when I see children um, walking on the streets of Accra or anywhere else I really get tired of them. That's how Summer Feet started and before Summer Feet started I had already um, started this thing with my birthday where on every birthday of mine I uh, put food together and go on the street to share to children. Some I videoed, some I did not video and I asked myself if I could do this all by myself, and the answer was no. And um, to encourage people to um, do the same thing as I was doing, I need to show them that I'm actually doing this to impact and to influence people to do the same. And that was when I took to the streets with cameras and started sharing food to the less privileged, and they started in 2018. Uh, where I um, fed over 500 children at Jamestown, and now we're about to um, do it again. And then I spoke to my team, and they said to me, Selma, this was after I shared with them what I actually wanted to do. I told them I wanted to do this for the children, I wanted to do this. They said, okay, then it all can't fall under um, Selma feet. So we need to come up with a Salomon Foundation where um, whenever you feel like feeding the children, you can feed them um, under a project, um, Salomon Feed, and whenever you feel like doing something else for um, any other needy, um, it being um, street kids or um, widows or um, mothers to hospitals or any other thing, you know. So we decided to come up with Salomon Foundation. That's how um, we, we, um, we are here today. Clap, clap, clap. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
So I believe she has summed up everything in one. But do you guys have questions? Obviously, because you are bloggers and media person. So. Um, so we have a little speech here about the foundation and what we are about to do within here. So my name is Solomon Women. I am from the Upper West region and before I became an actress, an entrepreneur, before I became a woman, I was a child. Growing up in Wa, I noticed there are many deprived children in our local communities without hope of what they can be in the future. There are children who spend their school time begging for money and food by the streets. There are children who do not grow to achieve their full potential because of hunger and complications from, the, um, from malnutrition. It is, um, it is the responsibility of each and every one of us to save these children. It is our duty to provide opportunities which were deprived from these children through death, broken homes and poverty, all which are not, all which are no fault of tears. I recommend all the organizations, both government and private, who are putting in effort to create mentorship and feeding programs for underprivileged children across the various regions. Unfortunately, this help hardly extends to the slums of the northern part of Ghana. The question I have always asked myself is, whose responsibility is this? So the Movement Foundation is not just an organization, but my duty. It is not just, um, it is not just justice, but a commitment to the future. Commitment to provide provocation and help for the well-being of our future leaders. Through our Salma Feeds program, under the Salma Moving Foundation, we fed over 500 street children in Jamestown in 2018. This program encourages a good community engagement between the deprived children and my team of professional caregivers and life coaches. In the quest of providing hope for more children, the next Selma Feed project is on the 15th January at WA, which is targeting to feed over 600 children and also provide foodstuffs to the canteen of two schools, namely Chegley Primary School and um, Ferry C La Primary, all in WA. Sorry, La Ferry C La Primary, all in WA. <laughs> We can do this alone. We cannot do this alone, so we are therefore open for any form of partnerships or collaborations to better the lives of these children. I want, us, um, I want to use this opportunity to express my sincere gratitude to the good people of Twilium Industry Limited, Onga and Lux Medicals, which is um, Unicamp Ghana, Slim Smart, they have given us some medicals to um, also give to the schools for them to um, be treated free of charge. And then, um, yes, so we thank you very much, Ben Thank you very much, Slim Smart. We thank you very much, Unicamp Ghana, and also Onga for coming on board for us. So, this is what we've got to offer. Thank you. Okay, so. Because here's a case, we keep hearing your colleagues and maybe sometimes yourself say that your craft hasn't been um, that, um, what was the word to use? Lucrative. It's not booming. And, oh, lucrative, yeah, yeah. booming and booming. And, and if that's your source of funding, I'm wondering how you can sustain this. And you keep saying that nobody has given you cash. The product they are giving you, you talked about the fact that you need other things to make it complete. I wish you think that there's another source of funding for you beyond what you do as an actress that will generate... Again, my no. source of income mm -hmm. is questioned. 
Oh no, 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 I want to know so that we don't have to worry about how this will be sustainable because I don't want us to hear you have done it this year. It's beautiful. Next year we don't see it and then you see it becomes a nine day wonder. Except there's some place that you have some money, you know, beyond what we know. So if we don't see you act crap, we know that oh, summer foundation, it will happen. As I said earlier, well, there's no problem. Ah, that's that's how we if we don't question those people out there, we don't get to see that we're not doing the highest paying things for that. Them. Especially now that they themselves are telling us that they don't make money from acting. So they are other sources. So let's Thank you. Miss G, I don't remember ever answering a question. Uh, but I answered that my business doesn't pay. Oh, not anyway. Um, about how to fund it. As I stated earlier in my. Um, um, yes, I'm yes. It's just not an organization. It is on duty. And there is also a saying that goes like, I cannot come and heal myself. I will not do what I cannot, I, can, I will not do what I cannot do. I have this trend this year to go and back on this um, project. I will next year, if the money doesn't come, I will not heal myself. And I don't expect my colleagues to kill themselves either. Hand go, hand come. One is there, we'll keep one is not there. We will not bother ourselves. I hope you understand. I understand. Yes. My second question, I've been looking at your logo. Mm -hmm. It looks quite familiar. I don't know whether I've seen it on any of your projects or I've seen it elsewhere. And you two, the logo... Yes. Which of them though? Is, this how is, is, that, is that your logo? Yeah. Is that your logo? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it looks like a logo I've seen elsewhere. You also, it looks to you. I've been looking at I tried Googling some of the things that look really? like it. Maybe you have to ask the person who Google for uh, who did it for you. It looks it looks like a logo that was taken from somewhere. No, um, okay, so that's why I say it looks like. Yes, yeah. I mean, I'm glad you said it looks like, but I didn't say it is. Mm. Yeah, because what we normally do is whatever that is being happened has happened before. So um, you took inspiration. We, yeah, we took inspiration from it, and it, every logo has a meaning. So you can see some children there, and you can see the star. Is basically trying to say that we want to light out the stars of children, and that is why it's more like a um, child care, time to take care of the social well-being of children. So that is the concept behind the logo. So that is the meaning. So it's actually new band. Are you also something? Well, um, um, yeah. I mean, every with brand when it comes to branding. Colors too has their meanings. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can see blue band. It's the same design, so can't, not to take you, but I'm just asking, maybe you have an expert idea, but can't somebody take you on just mm -hmm. because? Uh, you know, the same with this kind of design. Yeah. Same design. Like like default for foreign. Yeah, 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 so you just change the design. Because there is no reason to handle so it's not the same thing. Yeah, it's <laughs> Maybe you want to touch it before somebody raises concerns again. You know, when when because no, nobody can actually hold us against this because, as I mentioned um, in the beginning, every color has a meaning and every foundation has a purpose and every purpose too has colors. And always has to do with children and um, the blue and then the. Uh, green stands for children, and that is why it is there. The design might be the same, but the colors are not the same. And we didn't know, we didn't see, um, we thought it was the same colors. <laughs> Inspiration. Hello, everyone. My name is Salma Moomin, and we are the Marriott Hotel for the launch of Salma Moomin Foundation. Um, Salma Moomin Foundation is an NGO that. Um, is set to look out for the less privileged, being kids for now, our whole focus is on kids. And then um, so the Women Foundation has a project and the needs, which is the Selma Feet, and that is what we are supposed to introduce that to you. So Selma Women Foundation is a broad um, organization and has projects 
just so that um, we wouldn't focus on just one project. So we wouldn't have just one project for now, and maybe next year or the next time um, we we'll set to donate again, it's going to be um, on something else, on another um, project. So basically, we're here to launch the Summer Film Foundation and Summer Fees, and we're heading to WA, to some rural areas to donate to their schools, and also um, have food cooked and shared among the children as a party. So this will be here to do and doing this, I want to influence everybody out there uh, to do what they can do. I can do it. I can do all. So wherever you are, you are listening to me, just know that you can do it no matter how much you've got. No matter, um, you don't need to own a foundation to be able to do good. You can do it all the time to your neighbor, to your friend, to your family. You know, you're probably doing good. All I'm just saying that just give back. And also, um, some Women Foundation is looking to partner or to. Uh, Merge with sponsors and calling out, we're calling um, everybody to come on board, support, donate, help, it being cash, foodstuffs, clothes, anything at all. You know, we just get to support the needy and you can be part of us. Thank you. Yes, these are people I already work with and also some reached out to me. Um, I'm currently working with Lux Ghana Slim Smart. I don't know if you see the post on my social media platform. I'm currently working with them in some of Selma's um, history. You own. I own. <laughs> and also Vena um, Water, of course. Um, we worked together before, so it was really easy for them to do this. And knowing them for being very um, humanitarian, they didn't find any problem assisting me on this. And